What constitutes being a hero? Do you have to be a man in a suit made of iron? Or a guy shooting webs out of his hands? Or a war veteran? Maybe. But I would argue the real heroes are the people fighting the good fight on Twitter. So last night I came across these two tweets right here. Can't believe I spent 11 years of my life asking teachers if I was allowed to use the bathroom and sometimes be told no? What the fuck? Now don't get me wrong, I can totally get on board with this statement, but I guess my question is, who are you arguing against? You know, if there's actually someone out there arguing against this, I could see there being a point to this tweet. But I'm willing to bet there's not a single soul out there that's saying, you know what, no. It is our teacher's duty to make sure that by the end of class, there's at least four students sitting in a puddle of their own urine. But there's no one saying that. So I don't see the point in starting a goddamn uprising about this topic. But you know what? Maybe I'm the weird one. Maybe I went to a school where the bathroom was just open access. So I checked the replies under these tweets, and there was actually quite a few notable responses. Two stories. Because of this, I peed on myself in second grade, and am still ashamed at 23. <laughs> I mean, I, I feel, I'm sure all the kids in that class specifically remember you peeing your pants and probably still remember to this day and laugh about it with all their friends. A girl in my high school was on her period and wore skirts. The teacher said she couldn't go to the bathroom, so she changed her tampon behind the desk in class. No, I'm not, I'm not a girl, right, okay? But I'm sure, you know, taking out your tampon is something, something pretty embarrassing and not something you want to be doing in class. But if I asked my teacher, if I could go to the bathroom and they said no, that's when you whip it out and Kobe that shit right onto their desk, man. And if you had a problem with it, not my fault, you wouldn't let me go to the bathroom. In high school, you were only allowed to go to the bathroom during lunch and after school, but one time I had to pee so bad I begged for them to unlock it or let me use the teacher bathroom, but instead I got suspended. What school are these people going to? What the heck? They locked on the bathrooms, then like, what, what are they even for? Oh, excuse, excuse me, can I, can I please use the bathroom? I'm not, I know I'm not supposed to, but I, I really gotta go, man. Oh, sorry, the, uh, the bathroom's more, more of a decorative piece than, than something to be used, so, uh, sorry. Like, why have a bathroom if you're just gonna have, like, like, two bodyguards standing next to it, like, blocking that shit down? I don't know. I remember being in third grade, and I was so afraid to ask to use the bathroom, because the teacher would always yell at the kids, who would ask, so I pooped my pants and my dad got really mad at the teacher because I couldn't even ask him because I was so scared and traumatized. What? Well, that, that sounds like it's your problem. Like, <laughs> like, if you don't even ask the teacher and then you, you shit your pants in class, how is that the teacher's fault? Here's an interesting one. Prison. Authoritative structure, loss of individual freedom, no part in decision making, several times for walking, eating, wait, wait, a, wait a second. This is exactly, this is exactly like, like, school. like school. Wake up people, school is basically prison. You know, aside from the fact that you're not trapped in a 4 by 10 room behind bars, and you know, the fact that you get to go home to your family, and the fact that they're educating you to uh, give you a better future so you don't end up in a place like prison. But, I mean, other than that, it's, they're basically the same thing. That got 7,400 likes, by the way. I guess I'm just confused as to why these tweets blew up so much. Like, I thought it was common knowledge that, you know, you sign out, so God forbid there's an emergency, they know where the students are and, like, what time they were out. So I thought, you know, everyone was on board with, you know, that's the reason you asked to go to the bathroom. On top of that, like, 90% of the kids signing up to go to the bathroom are just going in there to vape. I swear to God, it's like a steam room in there every time I go to take a piss. I think the funniest part of this, though, is you guys know the saying, everyone gets their 15 minutes of fame. Imagine one day, you know, you're walking around with your friends and your phone just starts buzzing like crazy. Like, one of your tweets just... It's just blowing the fuck up, right? Like this, this, this is your 15 minutes right here, you know? And what is that tweet? It's your little, uh, it's your little I have a dream speech about the right to piss. <laughs> I don't know, man, I just think it's funny that this is like the hill that someone is willing to die on, you know? Well, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Middle.